Hello everybody, welcome to a new playthrough called Night Delivery. Um, this is a Chilla's Art game from 2021. Um, it's probably about one to maybe three hours long, so it'll be a few videos, nothing really crazy. Um, Chilla's Art is a pretty prolific indie horror game developer. This isn't their first game, but we'll get into the others in the future. This is my first time playing Night Delivery, um, so it'll be blind playthrough. Um, I've heard this one's pretty good. Um, I don't know much about it. Um, I do know there's two endings. There's a true ending, which is probably the good ending, and then a bad ending. I have uh, no idea which one we'll uh, end up getting. Um, so we're on English, there's apparently collected cans, a lot of cans that we can try to find. Um, I'm not necessarily going to be trying to find all of these or get the good ending. I don't know which ending we'll get, whichever one we get, I guess. Um, this game's $2.99 on Steam, so if you want to get it yourself, you can go check it out. The link's in uh, the description. Uh, so let's start the game. Delivery Man 31. Okay. Use mouse and WASD for movement. Press left mouse button to interact. Okay. This has got a kind of a VHS uh, filter. I think we, now we can get into the options. So here's the controls. Um, this this game has no mods or really anything to configure. Um, this game is made in the Unity engine, and games in that engine can be good games. They're not all bad, uh, but there's not really much configurability on the user end to adjust anything uh, as opposed to if it was something like an Unreal Engine game uh, you'd have more things you could adjust in files so WASD for movement or the arrow keys uh, interact with the left click tab is inventory shift is run and C is crouch so there's no jump let's look at the options Max volume, lowest sensitivity on the mouse, middle on the brightness. We'll see what the head bob's like. Usually I don't like head bob in most games. Uh, 1920 by 1080 full screen. 100% as high as I can go on the texture quality. I'm going to put uh, V-Sync on every vertical bank just so I don't get any screen tearing. Um, shadow quality, yep, hard and soft, no depth of field. I'm going to turn the VHS filter off so it's easier to watch. Apply. And I'm going to change my controls for how I play PC games. I use the arrow keys and the number pad uh, for PC games like this. I don't use uh, WASD. Tab, I will make that. Escape, it's fine. So no jumping. Apply, back, resume. Just checking controls out here, make sure everything's working. So it's one of these where you have to uh, hold the run key to run. Crouch. Nothing in the inventory. Apparently we can't turn the flashlight off. There's no map. Um, I made escape page down key, but it doesn't work. So I'll just have to use escape. Uh, 
Mouse sensitivity. Let's see how the. Uh, oops, I just messed that up. Put it at 30, I think it was, in the middle. Apply it again. Make sure everything else is still as I had it. Yeah. Okay, back. Resume. Let's see how bad the head bob is. It's okay. I'll leave it on. Okay. So we can't jump. Oh, this is my last stop. After I deliver these five packages, I'm done for today. Package. Okay. A, B, C, D, and E. I guess we'll start with A. Deliver this package. I still have to use W, A, S, and D to select these. Okay. Press tab to open inventory. You can also switch items using your mouse scroll. Well, he shut the door, so that means we can only carry one at a time, apparently. So yeah, if you're into the indie horror game scene, you have probably come across or played Chilla's Arts game. I have no idea where we're going. This flashlight's kind of crappy. I'm just walking around, seeing what happens. What is that? It's like a bottle of pills. I think it's a drink. Whoa, that's one of the cans. Okay. The collectible cans. Um... That sucks, you can't see. Maybe it's in the inventory screen. No, room 206, okay. It doesn't show, um, doesn't show how many cans we've collected. So you don't know how many you've actually found. But now we know what they look like. And there's a bunch of them, <laughs> so. I'll definitely be uh, brightening this game up. I might do a little brightening here uh, when I do the video editing. Um, let's see how high 20 is. That's a lot better. I think I may leave it like that because at least now I can see. That scared me. There's another bottle. <laughs> well, I can't read it, and there's no subtitles. There's another one. Chilla's art. somebody who knows in the comments can uh, tell me what some of those things are. If they're like anime or uh, manga or mangas. These cans are going to be like every two feet. I'm like creeping around behind these people's apartments and stuff. It's not creepy at all. I guess I could run. another one. Oh, I see it. <laughs> wow, these things are everywhere. I'd be really surprised if we end up finding all of them. I don't think we will. Just a moment, please. Okay, 
Sorry about that. Whoa. Was he there before? There's a dog staring at me. What do you have in your mouth? Frisbee. I can't take it from him. It just says dot dot dot. Yeah, I can't, I can't interact with him. I don't know if it's because I have the box or, or what. There's gotta be more cans laying around here. I don't think we're ever gonna get these boxes delivered. <laughs> we're too busy hunting for cans. I don't know, I can't pet him or anything. Maybe he'll be there later. There's got to be a can somewhere. Yep. Dry. Super dry. Can't open the door. It's fine. Yeah, this won't be like a mega long uh, playthrough, I don't think. Five videos, maybe. I uh, like to reference the website, uh, How Long to Beat. It lets you know uh, how long it takes to get through a game, roughly. There's a can. Sorry if my uh, mouse movement is really jittery. Uh, this game's sensitivity is pretty high. I can try to lower it. Drop the DPI down a little bit on the mouse. Alright, we can't go in here, so... Let's continue uh, creeping around the property. <laughs> I imagine there's a can going to be on the edge. But I'm not sure. Mm. There's one. Yeah, there's another one. Here's the actual <laughs> front that we've walked around. So it said in the inventory 206. That's 106, so it should be that one right there. We don't have to go up there immediately. day. There's a can. <laughs> Some lemonade, I guess. Kind of looks like a uh, rip-off uh, Red Bull can. Not saying it is, but the pattern looked similar. There's another can. Hmm. Okay, so... I was trying to bring up my uh, frame rate and all that stuff, but my keybind's not working. Nothing I can do. There's a can. There's a cat.
I don't remember, like, I've played a bunch of Chilla's Arts games. I think there's always, like, a cat. He's trying to attack me. He won't let me in there. When I try to open it, he sw swipes at me. I guess he wants something. Yeah, I think we've made a loop. I think that's the truck. Oh, cool. He's running. So yeah, the game's a little blurry. There's nothing I can do about it. It's just... Uh, Chilla's Arts games kind of have that lo-fi quality, which is fine. Okay. So yeah, we've made a full circle. Don't know if we've missed any cans. I'm sure we have. The majority of them are probably out here. There's one. Pick it up. UMYA.net. Just trying to look on this other side real quick. I mean, we've looked pretty good over here, I think. I'm surprised there's not one right in the corner. Oh, well, there's one there. Energy. All right, let's go to the actual delivery. Cat is still there. I don't really know what he wants, but he doesn't want to let me in here. Okay. Six, so there's five floors. Wow. Two oh six is where we're going. Looks like there's an elevator. Okay. This is where we came in from out here. So we can go to the elevator, we can just go up the stairs. Let's go up the stairs. So it's down here. But yeah, Chilla's art is really prolific. Um, I don't know much about them. I, I assume it's like one person. <laughs> It probably does all of these games, maybe a couple of people, but I'm not really sure. But they've released a lot of games, and a lot of really cool games too. Alright, let's see if they're here, I guess. Can't ring this bell. Doorbell intercom, knock on the door. What should I do? Uh, doorbell. <laughs> Question. Dot, dot, dot. Um, knock. It was 206. Yeah. Not yet. Do the doorbell again. Okay, what do I do with it? I can't like put it on the ground. I can't shove it in that mail drop. Whoa, holy crap. 
What happened? You all right, dude? Uh, you took way too long. Get the hell out of my face. <laughs> what did he do? He looked like he just punched me. Took the box. <laughs> Have a nice day. God, what a jerk. I thought he was going to throw up on me. Okay, that's one package down. We'll take the elevator back up next time. So I'm assuming we go get another box. Yeah, the door is just magically open now. <laughs> Okay, let's get number package B. Deliver this package, yes. I wish I could take them all at once, but I guess you're not allowed to do that. Nope. All right, so now we have 502. We gotta go to the very top floor. Take the elevator this time. It's a small elevator. Okay, five. Nice. Five oh two, five oh one. So this one. Doorbell. Hello. Thanks. I have a reward for your great service. <laughs> you love cats too, don't you? Take it and be conned. She just gave me cat food. <laughs> Thanks. I have her. Oh, she's talking to me again. Okay. Cat food. Well, it's your lucky day, buddy. Sorry, the flashlight's so bright, not much I can do about it. Still gonna brighten the game up in editing, but uh, yeah, it looks better that I've maxed the brightness out. Okay, cat, here you go. Kohi, how are you doing? How's the new apartment? The previous apartment you had to move because the residents there weren't so kind to you. Is it okay this time? Before there were people who made a fool of themselves about disabilities and welfare, right? I said it many times before, you weren't the bad one. Don't blame yourself. Also, don't be impatient about getting a job. Kohi, you're my son. You'll be okay. Things will get better, Mom. All right. Whoa. Dude's up there looking at me. I think that's the guy from two oh six. creeping. Alright, what we're actually going to do before we get this package is go back and see if we can interact with that dog. I already forgot about him. 
He's back here by the uh, playset. Dot, dot. Well, he obviously wants you to read it. I don't know why he's not reading it. Just one moment, please. Trying to sell a couple of guitars on Offer Up, and just had somebody message me. All right, well I don't know what to do with the dog. He does not want to interact. So let's go get the next package. to 401 okay he's still standing there cat's gone there's no drinks in here that I can see Trash bag sticking through the back. Bottle of water. Okay. Okay, I can switch between <laughs> the bottle of water or the package. Alright, we're going to 401. I guess he'll be gone when we come up here. Uh, that wasn't very nice. Guess we're going back down. Let's go to three and try to get off those stairs. What is going on? Huh. Some more stairs over here. Chi. Maybe the elevator's cleared now. Yeah, he's gone. Creeper. Try the elevator again. Or we could go to five and then go downstairs. That's probably what we're supposed to do. Yeah. Still blocked. Let's go to five and then walk down. Take a drink. Water here. Okay. Any 
There we go. All right, 401. 401. Doorbell. Hey. I'm scared. Am I the only one? Aren't you scared? This whole place, it's like I'm becoming a part of them. Never mind. Forget about it. <laughs> oh. Me? I haven't left the room in... I don't know. I stopped counting. Oh, right. You're here for a package. I'm here to deliver a package. <laughs> Don't know if I can trust you and your parcel just yet. Talk to the priest. I can't trust you until you talk to the priest. He said he lives in apartment number 105. Talk to the priest. Uh, or I could just throw the package on the ground. 105, okay. Five. He's gone. It's down here. One oh five. Knock. <laughs> okay. Hi, Tisk. Huh? I see. Mikuru sent you here. I'm the local priest. Say no more. I can sense that the package is cursed. But I need to make an offering first before I can perform any sacri sac sanctification of the object. Monetary, that is. Tisk. I need cash before I can perform any sanctification on the object. Well, I got a bottle of water. Okay. Well, I guess we go back to that guy now. <laughs> Back up to floor five. Walk down. So the package is cursed, apparently. spoke to the pr pr priest D directly how lucky you are I've only exchanged words through the door intercom so he needs money why of course what the priest says is always right here give this to him make sure he make sure to give it to him ASAP I don't want the priest to be waiting any longer <laughs> Money, all right. So back to one oh five. Thought I heard something. Right, 
Alright guys, I'm going to stop the first video here. Uh, I don't know what's going on yet. We're just delivering packages. <laughs> Nothing crazy's really happened yet. Alright, so I appreciate you watching, and we'll see you in the next video. Bye.